Writer of the Year Award, a writer who has inspired so many of us. Steve Faulkner of Michigan's Blue Lake News. How many people have the opportunity to acknowledge the accomplishments of a lifetime? He's always at work, always. And then when he comes home, he doesn't know how to talk to me and I don't know how to talk to him. The point is, I'm gonna be going off to school soon and I was just thinking that maybe if him and I, we took some time. A canoe trip with your father, is that what you're saying? And where? Maybe the Mississippi. I would love to go on this trip and write a book about it. It's the last chance that you're gonna to get to get to know your son before he leaves home for good. It's gonna be over a thousand miles, one way. Say if we're gonna do it, we have to do it like Marquette and Juliet did it, no shortcuts. <laughs> All right. Deal? Yeah, it's a deal. If you notice, since this whole canoe trip business came up, he's actually talking to you. Now, if you could just learn to talk back. Whither thou goest, I will go. In similar circumstances, would travel with another into the unknown, bound only by love. It's a compass, so I know you'll find your way back home. The journey of a thousand miles begins with a single dip. It's a double dip, Dad. <laughs> right. I've watched a lot of people like you try to sail these waters. This is not like the Travel Channel. You need to realize your canoe was not built for lakes like this one. It's true. We're boldly going where no man has gone before. Dad, the barge. The barge is coming in. Mm -hmm.